Hello super users, let's learn how to split chords quickly. Let's say you have a bunch of chords and you want to split it into layers like that. Or maybe you have horn parts and you want to split it into parts 1, 3, and 2, and 4, just like that. Or maybe you have woodwind parts like this that you want to split into pairs like that. Or perhaps you have a part like this that you want to split into layers, like that. That was all real time and this video will help you learn how to split chords quickly. Now the way you get this done is in three different parts. The first part is RGP Lua, which is the successor to JW Lua. The second thing is a Lua script that will actually split the pairs. And the third thing to make this so fast is using some sort of macro program to have keyboard shortcuts trigger this all. And this is all based off a project I have been working on with several members of the Finale community to quickly speed up our Finale workflow. You can do things like create indeterminate clusters, create advanced notation. You can even fix annoying finale bugs like getting hairpins to look right and even doing things like deleting excess articulations. And everything you need to know about this is on this site. So to get started, first head over to finalelua.com and click up here on help and install plugin. This is the instructions for helping you to install the RGP Lua plugin. Select your operating system. I'm on Mac OS. Select your version of Finale. And finally, select which version of the plugin you want to use. RGP Lua is recommended. Select that if you have the option. And then it will give you detailed instructions on how to install this plugin. The exact process is slightly different for everyone, but essentially it involves downloading this RGP Lua file and making sure it is under your plugins folder inside Finale. Then once you have that installed, you want to go over here to view scripts. And in here, we're going to find the uh, explode stave scripts. And these are a set of four different scripts that you can use to do the different exploding functions. And if you need help installing Lua scripts, I have a video linked below the like button. Or alternatively, you can go up here to help and install scripts this time. And here are the written instructions for installing Lua scripts. Once you have the scripts installed, you should be able to select some measures in Finale and then go to plugins, Lua, and find the staff explode plugins. Now to get them working as fast as I was before, we're gonna instead use a program on Mac OS called Keyboard Maestro. Basically it lets us create macros. So if I were to hit the hotkey E, then it'll automatically run plugins, Lua, staff explode for us. So that way we don't have to go through the menu bars and we can do it with a quick keyboard shortcut. And Keyboard Maestro is the number one time-saving tip on Mac OS. And if you wanna know more about how to use it to its fullest, I have an entire course on my channel that it, you can use for free and it is probably one of the best things you can do to speed up your workflow. If you're on Windows, instead you want to use a tool called Auto Hotkey, which also allows you to do extreme automation on Windows. And if you want to learn more about using Auto Hotkey with Finale, I'd recommend this blog post by Jacob Winkler, all about automating Finale with Windows using Auto Hotkey.